after working for so many years, folks usually retire, but... We're all living longer lives. You need to have more money to support the longer life that you're going to live. So what happens when you have more years in your life, you have more years in your career. We spoke to CEO of the Velaz Group, Adam Mendler, to learn how the older workforce can stay in the know at their jobs. First, become an expert in your industry. The most successful people are people who are dedicated to learning, dedicated to a continual quest for knowledge. Stay on top of industry publications, attend industry events, learn from influencers and experts within your space, and keep up with trends that impact the broader environment. Read publications like TechCrunch, follow Futurists, and take the time to listen to the people around you. Next, volunteer for new assignments. The more siloed you are within your organization, the greater the risk you run of becoming obsolete. If all you are is the person who does this one specific task, what happens if that task no longer becomes relevant? By volunteering, by taking on new projects, by taking on new assignments, you're gonna be able to put yourself in a position where you'll be more relevant than you were before. Adam's third tip, spend time with younger generations. Take the time to strike up conversations with millennials, with Gen Zers. We don't bite, we're friendly. Start off by understanding what might be an area of commonality between someone in your life, whether it's a coworker, whether it's a relative, whether it's a neighbor who's of a different generation. Use that common interest to create connections because... There's no better way to understand today's generation than by spending time with today's generation. Finally, keep up with technology through online coursework. There's a whole spectrum in terms of the types of technologies that you can become expert in, whether we're talking about things like data science or even things like learning how to become better at typing. You can take courses from edX, LinkedIn Learning, Coursera, that can help you develop the skill set that will allow you to become more proficient in technology. Adam says it's normal to be intimidated, but... Don't be afraid to just dive in. It doesn't matter where you are in your career. It doesn't matter where you are in your life. Just go for it. Keeping baby boomers in the workplace is on the top of the list.